for 15k right now for sure c2 c3 corvette average condition for that price definitely for 15k i'm going for that black with red interior obviously i think after driving one a few weeks ago i'll have to go for a honda s2000 it was too too much fun so that's my first choice. I would buy a Volkswagen camper van. Basically, it's perfect for a camping weekend. Well, if it was unregistered and um, I could just drive it around on the road, probably an E46 M3 manual because there are some really good cars and they're really cheap now. If I had to register it, probably a 1990 E31 8 series because after working on the blue one not too long ago, I just really fell in love with the shape and the car and it even shares a lot of the same parts as my 7 series. So it was like an obvious choice for me to go for that car. If I had to choose a pre-war car, I would go for the Austin 7. A 1930s car, I would probably try to find a two-seat open tourer for that price. The Austin 7 is a lovely little car. I like it because it's very basic and very simple to work on. Many have been manufactured in the 30s and there are still many around. And another good thing about them is that they're very well supported from Austin 7 clubs and groups with parts. So it would be very easy to restore one. Post-war, I would go for the MG Midget, a public car from the 60s. I had seen one a couple of years ago and it was in very, very good condition, practically concourse. And they were only asking 10,500 euros for the car. I regret not buying it today. Kiko Kelly Nishtri Karotsa, Behmista Shellel Fillum in Jurnata, Shkarotsa Nishtri. They am in Harris Lane, Classic G. They am Kelly Del Passioni, Al MGB. Probabilment even Air John Harris in MGB din it darbat kun uh, MGB GT Peresli of Yament din kienet karotza li dejje mux bitni Probabilment bih mistax l-elf of Yament wihet Ikun jista jishtri din it tip ta karotza uh, Ukol ikun jista jirranġa hafna fariet iktar uh, fiha